Good morning. morning. We're back for another story. I have Ethan here. Ethan, you remember how old you are? One. Four. <gasps> Four. Good job. And Zia, how old are you? Um, three. Three soon. Three. You're almost three. And if you remember last week, we read a story about Jacob and Esau and how Jacob tricked his brother Esau. And do you remember how he tricked him? Tricked him for his birthright. Yeah, Jacob tricked Esau into giving him his birthright. Good job. And he tricked him uh, one other time. Do you remember how he tricked him again? No. He tricked his dad into giving him a blessing. So today we're going to read a little bit more about Jacob. What happened after that? So get your coloring sheets. You want to show your coloring sheet? Hold it up high. And let's read our story. Jacob has a dream. Jacob tricked his father and his brother Esau. Esau was so angry he wanted to hurt Jacob. Jacob was afraid. Jacob's mother told him to run away to his uncle's house where he would be safe. So Jacob walked all day. When it was night, he stopped to sleep. He laid down on the ground and put a stone under his head for a pillow. While Jacob slept, he had a dream. He saw a stairway reaching up to heaven. He saw angels on the stairway. They were going up and down. At the top of the stairway, Jacob saw God. God told Jacob that he would make Jacob's family into a great nation. God promised to be with Jacob and to take care of him. Jacob woke up and promised to obey God. Okay, I'm going to quiz you guys on the story, see how well you were listening, okay? Do you remember whose house Jacob's mom told him to go to? Do you remember? No? Do you remember, Zaya? Because... His uncle's house. Uncle's house. Yep, she told him to run away to his uncle's house. Do you remember on the way to his uncle's house, do you remember, um, what Jacob had a dream about? Yeah. Yeah? How about, do you remember, um, in Jacob's dream, do you remember who was going up and down the stairs? The angels. The angels, good job. That was his dream. That was in his dream. Yep, he had a dream about that. And what did God promise Jacob in his dream? No. To take care of him and to be with him. And then at the end of the dream, when, when Jacob woke up, he woke up and he promised to obey God. So thanks for watching our story. I hope you learned some things. Go color your picture and we'll see you next week.